do well. Okay, so starting to work now um, prone and I'm just going to reinforce that release of the whole spine by sweeping down Joe's back. So double fist with thumbs crossed and my knuckles are either side of the spine. No oil here, this is a sweep down the fascia of the back, nice and slow, giving the fascia a chance to warm, to soften, to start to melt a little bit. I'm just going to adjust my feet so I'm not overstretching. Just letting Joe's body yield to that steady pressure right the way down to the sacrum. Lovely sound. Okay, and then I'm going to be focusing on the upper back and shoulders coming up into the neck. I need a little bit of grip. So, some effleurage and some kneading. Particularly emphasizing the sweep of muscles that come up into the neck. So here we are with upper traps, levator scapulae, the scalenes, and feeling for any areas that are a little bit restricted, a little bit knotty. Oh, there's one. <laughs> and Bit of a trigger point there. Joe, how does that feel? Yeah, I can feel it, but it feels like it's trying to release. Okay, to stay with it. Mm. Okay. So I'm just focus pressure, it's fingertips like so, so they're supporting each other, and the other hand is on top. And you may notice that I'm just bouncing up and down in my ankles a little bit, so there's a vibration going into that trigger. And it's a way of coaxing it to let go. It's been working too hard for too long. It needs to chill out a bit. Yeah, ooh. And there's quite a few around here. Mm. <laughs> Another one just above. Again, focus pressure and I'm just Bouncing up and down in my ankles, putting a bit of a vibration through it, sweeping up, back of the neck. Oh. Quite often use this knuckle, really nice tool that you can wriggle it into all sorts of nooks and crannies. You've got the support of the fist behind it. Coming up to the mastoid process at the back of the ear, and that's a very important place for muscle attachments. And I'm just putting a stretch onto the upper trapezius. Joe, when you're ready, can you gently push that shoulder towards me? Just push it up. Hold it, hold it, hold it. Just a little bit longer. And release. As she lets go, I get a bit more length coming into the muscle. So, in terms of an approach, there's effleurage, there's kneading, feeling for trigger points, gritty, knotty, lumpy bits. Holding those with pressure, not quite so gritty on this side, a little bit there, 
Think about a pulsing through it, a little bit of a bounce from your ankles. And then maybe an MET, a muscle energy technique, an assisted stretch, it's all the same stuff. Gently push towards me, Joe, that's lovely. Just enough to switch the muscle on. Get it thinking that it's working. And release, let it go. Let it go. And as she lets go, I take up the slack and put a bit more length in there. Smashing. So. Let's leave it there. Thanks, Joe. <laughs>